The victory is Ghana's fourth in the competition's history after previous triumphs in 1993, 1999 and 2009. The Black Satellite kick-started the 2021 edition of the Africa Cup of Nations on a high, beating Tanzania 4-0. They then drew 0-0 with Morocco before losing 2-1 to the Gambia. In the quarterfinals, they triumphed over Cameroon, winning 4-2 on penalties after playing 1-1 draw over 120 minutes. The team then beat the Gambia in the semi-finals to clinch an act of sweet victory against the Scorpions. Abdul Karim Zuto's men then went a step better, grabbing the trophy as they emphatically disposed of their Ugandan counterparts, Ketsi Ebrace by Daniel Efriye Barnier. The team was met at the Air Force Base in Accra by the Minister for Youth and Sports, Mustafa Usi, and some sporting dignitaries. Upon their arrival, the minister said the win by the team is the best Independence Day present for the country and thanked the delegation on behalf of the president, Nana Akufuado. Three weeks ago, you left this country empty-handed and you are here today with us with gold medals and a trophy. You couldn't have given us any better independence gift than this. This is a befitting independence anniversary gift that you are giving to His Excellency the President of the Republic and the good people of this our great country. Like the President said, the whole country is proud of you. His Excellency the President of the Republic of Ghana, Nana Adudanko Ekufuado, is so proud and excited for what you have done for this our great country. And like he said, he can't wait to receive you at the seat of government the Jubilee House. The coach of the side, Abdul Karim Zitu, highlighted that it is important to promote and instill progressive development rather than focusing so much on winning trophies at the youth level. Uh, God, God has blessed Ghana with talents. When we want to talk about talents in Africa, uh, everybody knows that there's talent in Africa. But our main problem, as you actually you know, is the structure. The, the progressive transition of the team. That is our problem. Because most of you, some of you, go well, the moment we are in youth development, it's not about winning. It's about development. But the moment under 17 goes out and they are beaten, then they, you discard the team. So now, this team you see, I started with them from under 15. I have three of them from under 15. Now, they, they were the core of under 17 I took to Niger and then we played uh, finals against Nigeria. Eight of them are in this team. Imagine. So gradually we are going. And now, by his grace, maybe three or four to graduate to the uh, national team. So we should be very, very uh, optimistic about development.